And thank you for the community here. We sure didn't expect this today. And, and uh, I guess that's all. The father of Hawkeye legend, Chris Street, just as humble as Hawkeye fans remember, thanking the Indianola community and two star Hawkeyes from the past for a big surprise today. Today would have been Chris Street's 51st birthday. Good evening, I'm Dave Price. And I'm Lindsay Burrell. It was an amazing morning at the high school gym where Street first started turning heads years ago. Former Hawkeye teammates Jess Settles and Kenyon Murray were at Indianola High School with his family, friends, and students all to remember Chris on his birthday. This year also marked the 30th anniversary of his death in an automobile accident. Recently, the Street family was honored at Carver Hawkeye Arena and a win over Northwestern. Murray and Settles talked about the positive impact that Chris and his family have had on Iowa. You know, um, I always say about Mike and Patty and the girls is for them to continue to do the things that they do in the public eye are so important not only to keep Chris's legacy, his life, and his spirit alive, but it's also to touch people, whether it's communities or kids like yourselves, people like me that continue to touch. Some life lessons that, that Chris keeps teaching us 30 years later. Chris was a kid who would, he would deal with it immediately. He would put it on the table, he would confront, and he would say it. And, and that is something that has helped me in my lifetime. If there was something that wasn't right, he would go up into the office and talk to the coach. He wouldn't try to ruin the coach. He wouldn't try to undermine his teammates. He wouldn't try to get a parent. He would just go deal with it. Settles went on to tell the story of being down after his freshman season, saying that he knew his playing time went up due to Street's death and that he carried that guilt. Then coach Dr. Tom Dave told him to go to Indianola and see the streets. He did fishing and hunting with Mike Street, saying it changed his young life. 